Hello everyone and welcome back to Lucius 2. Um, I think we're on the yeah we're on the fourth floor here now. Uh, no loose ends. I think this is the part where we're supposed to kill Charles Wagner, aka our father. Um, also, I should just tell you that I have been upgrading some things. I've been upgrading my telekinesis. Uh, I, I, I don't really care much for mind control, but I love being able to pick things up with my mind and stuff. And apparently next I can go invisible. Oh, I have a point. Ah, now I can go invisible. Imagine that. So, uh, I don't know how that's going to help me, probably in a lot of different ways. Oh, oh, I see. Everything in here is, like, not supposed to be messed with. So I should probably mess with it. Okay, I just got a list of phone numbers so I can actually call people now. I don't really know how that does anything. Okay, it's floor two phone numbers. Isn't that a little late? Oh, wait, no, I'm going down floors, aren't I? Okay. Whoa, no, 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 no. Don't make me kill you. Don't make me kill you, ma'am. Kelly Brown. Making some report regarding ICU patient, huh? Well, I see you right there, and you're about to die. <whistles> Kelly! Kelly, I need you in my life right now. Sweetie, darling, I miss you. Get over here. Oh, oh, here she comes. And boop! That ought to do it. Okay. That's, whoa, look at that ass. Don't look at a dead body. Oh, don't make me kill you, too. Bitch, bitch, what'd you do to me? Why, where am I going? <laughs> Everything's okay. Everything's okay. I just gotta get up. Pretend nothing ever happened. Shut the door over here. Wait, do you have a key? Can I take your key? Oh, no. I can't take your key. Okay, I'm gonna throw something at your face. Um, I don't have time. Get out of here. Let's just run. <gasps> oh, look in there. There's little babies in there. Youngling number three. Jeffrey Dahmer. Oh my god, that is the name of a serial killer. James Gum. That's probably a serial killer as well. Jason Voorhees and Freddy Krueger is freaking Freddy Krueger. Okay, I think I need to kill all these babies, guys. I apologize, but it is gonna have to happen. Hey, you! You got any of them, um, keys for the baby killing room? Yes, she does, I think. 50 C yep, she's got keys for the baby killing room. I'm gonna go find a way to kill you. I'll be back in a minute. His parents must have been horrible to him. Oh, crap. They're talking about me. Are you guys- Don't talk about my family like that! Okay, they were good people until I killed them, and one of them is still alive! So Jesus, at least wait till he dies before we talk about him. Yeah. Or we can do other stuff. Holy shit, this guy is a pedophile. I need to kill him. That sick bastard. Oh, don't touch me. Nope, nope, I don't think so. There's a pedophile already came after me once. I'm getting the hell out of here. Don't you look at me. Oh, oh, something is happening. Something is happening. Oh! <gasps> Charlie, is that you? Papa? I'm coming for you, buddy. Don't worry. Does he see me? His eyes are open. Four. Oh, oh, oh my god. What the hell? I don't even know what four does. <laughs> I pressed the number four, and it seemed to be a good idea anyway. Something blew up and killed him. Um, number four. Oh, use items from a distance. That's what it was. Okay. All right. Rest in peace there, you bastard. This is the supply room key. I hope I don't find any naked dudes banging this time, but you never know. Okay, so I think my next job here is probably to kill this pedophile. I've never tried to use a machine to do this before, a vending machine. I'm just gonna place that there if I can. Come on. It says conductive. Doesn't, isn't that what conductive means? You bastard. Okay, it's orbiting my head now. My head is now a celestial body. I don't know why this is happening. Lucius, can you stop fucking around for a minute? You can't, can you? Drop that shit. These are mine. Get over here. Ah. Thank you very much. I love being able to control things in my mind. It's so fun. You guys wouldn't happen to have any coffee in here, would you? You think maybe? Just a little bit of coffee? I wish I could walk up behind him and just stab him in the back, but I can't. I could throw a can at his head, but that probably wouldn't do much. Uh, your room sucks, so I'm leaving, okay? Ooh, what does this do? The ICU door switch? <laughs> That's where Charles Wagner is. I'm coming for you, Charlie. I'm coming for you. Charlie! How you doing, buddy? Lucky man to have survived the massacre and fire. Not so lucky anymore, though, because I'm about to do this. Are you ready? <laughs> okay, come on. There, it took long enough. Everybody else, when I did that, they just died right away. Shh, Charlie. Charlie, everything's gonna be okay, buddy. Come here. Come here. You just need to get out for a walk, okay? Let's go for a walk together. This is probably gonna alert some people if I do that, actually. You stay here. I'll, I'll do the walking for you. Okay, guys, I found the coffee machine. That means that I can now poison this thing with this poison here, and that will allow me to get into the kids' room. 
where the little babies are, the little serial killers. So just put the pills in there. There we go. Okay, pills used in coffee pot. Just gotta wait for her to come back. Hello? Ma'am? I heard you brewing coffee a minute ago. I know you're here. Just get out here. I like how she's totally not concerned about the kid following her around. There you go. Drink some coffee. There you go. Okay, we're good. Did she just try and ask me if I'm lost while she's writhing in pain? <laughs> oh, you. You crazy. You crazy woman. I'm gonna go over here and kill some kids or something. Wait, no, I don't want to kill kids. I, I am a serial killer. Well, we'll find out anyway. I'm gonna go throw a can at it. Four? Hey, I used it from a distance. Okay, now, what can I do? What is this use? What, what, am I, what am I doing to the kids? Man kills children from the neighborhood with claws. Oh, oh, you get a little thingy. You, you get a little, um, a little newspaper fragment about how the, the serial killers did their things. And here we go, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Let's see, see what happened here. Crystal Lake murder spree, Jason killing from the grave. Sure, yeah, absolutely. We're turning the children to uh, to follow our cause. We're planting bad things into the children's minds. Milwaukee cannibal eats us. Eat, love, and pray. <laughs> Jeffrey Dahmer. Okay, one left. The, the last one here. James Gumb. I'm not actually familiar with this person, so we're going to find out what they did. Man kept women in well. Oh, that guy. It puts the lotion on the skin. Oh. Shoot wooden sticks. What are you? Oh, okay. Oh my God! You put the wooden wooden stick in the in the compressor. No. Yes. Oh goodness gracious! And then you when you call that guy on the phone, you can shoot him in the face. Holy crap! Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. So we take our phone. We got to dial his number now. Get over here, buddy. I got a phone call for you. It's your mother. She's got ice cream in the oven for you. Hi. Do you want to come to the phone now? Hey, buddy. Not supposed to be here. Well, come on and get me. What are you gonna do? He's too lazy to get up. He is fat and lazy. I, I I saw him eat donuts earlier. I don't know if that's why. Maybe. Doesn't seem to mind me being here. All right, can I take your keys maybe while I'm here? Oh yeah, sure. Now you grab me. Come on, buddy. This there you go. This time he's gonna do it. And stand up. And I should be able to shoot you. Yeah, it worked. Let me see where I, he got shot. I need to know. He got shot right through the shoulder. Okay, that, that should be effective enough. I have an idea. I have a way that I can kill the pedophile. I don't know if I can do something with the vending machine. But since, I, since I'm not sure what to do with it, I'm just going to control him, okay? I'm just going to go over here. I'm going to grab him. And he's going to get up. Creepy bastard. And he's going to walk over here and stand up in front of the phone, okay? And then I'm going to shoot him. Okay, go, run, quick. Did I get him? I think I almost shot my... I did shoot myself. Ouch, that kind of hurt. Hello there, Mr. Pedophile. Would you like to talk to me? Do you want to ask me to do something with you? Okay, you don't. That's fine. I'll just hit you in the head with this. Okay. Right at the head. Boom! Oh, shit! Not again! I keep hurting myself! What do you got on you? You got money? Oh, you got pills. Alright. Just get out of the way, burning body. What the hell? What the hell is this? A blood bag. And it looks like there's something in there. Is that a heart? I'm coming for you. Here we go. <laughs> really? That's how it's gonna work? Oh, the other guy got away. Are you kidding me? You are a suspect. I didn't do it! Dude, look at me. I'm a kid. Gaylord? Don't you trust me? Oh, okay. All right, I see how it is. Yeah, you better leave, Jace, because I got this guy to kill over here. Thank you. Jeez, people are always sticking their nose in other people's business. Oh, shit, no. No, 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 Jace, Jace, come back. Come back. Wait, I got some acid. I'll throw it at you. It'll Everything will be fine. Oh, and he's murdered. I, I, deadly force. This guy ran into some floating wallets and died? That is not possible. There is no way that's what happened, but it really seems to... Seems to point that way. What's this? Poison blood bag. All right, I'll take that. I'll, I'll bring that over here. Jeez. <laughs> he's gonna put the he's gonna put the heart in there. That is not how you hold a heart. Okay. Jesus Christ! <laughs> did, they both, did they both die? Really? 
That was the most ridiculous death I've ever seen in this game. He puts the heart in the body and everything explodes. There is so much blood and green stuff everywhere. I gotta come in and have a look at that. This is beautiful. You better admire this one. I see a circular saw blade here. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. I think I might be able to use some pliers on it. I can break it. It's broken now. I wouldn't recommend you use it. Can you move a little bit to the left so I can saw your dick off? Okay, is, is he, is he, yeah, there he's, he's good. Go! Hey! I took off his arm. I would have liked to take off his head, but arms are just as good. He's flailing around. Look, lady, listen here. I'm gonna run over here and grab these, okay? You ain't, you ain't gotta worry about me. I'm not, don't call us. Aha! You thought you could mess with me, huh? You can't. Oh, Charles Wagner's personal stuff. I will take that. Oh, I got a number. Okay, that's what I wanted. That is what I wanted. Seven, nine, two, one. Okay, there we go. We did it. Now somebody's going to come pick us up, right? At this point, he called me. Oh, MacGuffin. Yeah, Jesus. Okay, so we got a couple things left to do before we leave the hospital. We need to get some records and a morgue key or something like that. And I got my tricycle because I totally forgot to use it last time. So we're just going to ride around here. Nobody bothers, uh, you know, questioning a kid riding around on a tricycle in the hospital. Look at this. Whee! <laughs> Opening all the doors up and shit. What are you at? Oh shit, not supposed to be here. Not supposed to be here. Okay, I think what I need to do here is actually get someone inside the decompression chamber. I don't know how that works. But I'm going to try and do it. Maybe I can control that guy. Here's the deal, friend. You looking for something? I'm going to mind control you. Nobody's going to know because I'm just a kid. Then I'm going to put him in the decompression. Excuse me. Going in decompression, sir. Like that. Okay. And then I run over here and I shut the door and I lock the door. There you go. Okay. You go ahead and leave. Um, that door's locked and I'm going to compress. There you go. Let's see how that looks. Okay, or not. Oh man, his head didn't even explode. What kind of compression room is that? There was no compression happening. Well, I got some keys to something, apparently. Hello, sir. Good day. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Bad stuff in there. That guy just dropped dead in front of me, and I didn't even do anything to him. Uh, did you... Did he somehow drink that coffee from far away? I tried to poison the other guy, and he died. I hate it when that happens. Jesus. If you freaking dare use that- Oh, Jesus, he died. I wish people would stop dying from the coffee that I'm trying to give to that guy. And don't you dare call me sweetie. What would happen if I threw acid at, at this guy? You think that could hurt him? Yes, it can. It burns his skin. Well, that's one way to do it. Okay, I just need your key. Oh, what do I hear? Somebody is taking a shower in there. Oh, it's a women's shower, too. Maybe. I don't know. This is a women's shower door, but, but that's the shower door as well. I don't, I don't know. I see we've got a visitor here. Here to see your grandmother, are you? If my grandmother is the lady currently taking a shower, then yes. I'm here to see my grandmother. Hey, wait for me, lady. Wait for me. I got something to show you. Ugh. There you go. Okay, you didn't see anything, woman. And now we get to go to the shower. Oh, Lucius, you dirty bastard. Let's go in and see who's in there. It's probably a dude. But it might not be. You gotta go in quietly. Shh. Shh. Oh, yeah, it is a dude. Okay. Yeah, that's right. We gotta kill this dude who's in the shower. Well, this just got really anticlimactic here. What is he using? Shampoo. It's an open shampoo bottle. I, there's lots of ways to kill this guy. What if I creep up on him? And, uh, take his shampoo. Come on, take, take the shampoo. Take this, Jesus, I'm, I'm way too close right now. I'm right up in this guy's butthole. Ooh, I'm gonna turn on a shower. Ooh, scary. Okay, apparently this guy was behind all of this. I'm not really sure what this is. I mean, a bunch of shit happened at the hospital, but uh, I need to find a good way to kill him now. You think me throwing this acid at his head will, uh, will distract him at all? Maybe I should knock his shampoo down. You'll die without your shampoo. It, nothing happened. Okay, let me just grab it again. Nope. Oh, you, you didn't see anything. Keep showering, you bastard. All right, I'm going to shoot him with the bottles of gas again, guys. Okay, there we go. Just a little bit too, too much. There we go. Okay. Yeah. Oh, double deadly force. Oh, God, that's that's a penis. All right, buddy. Um, 
I'll save you guys from the look of his penis any more than I already have shown you. But uh, he's dead now, okay? Alright guys, so we just killed the administrator of the hospital and apparently the door to leave is right here. We have to go to the morgue first. There's a bunch of stuff in here. I'm not really sure what I have to do right now. So I think this is probably a good spot to end. Next time we'll, uh, we'll figure out the best way to kill all these guys in this room and then we'll go outside. And then we'll actually be in town and then you can, I don't know, run around and kill people who are just hanging out. Apparently people can get hit by cars because I saw that is one of the achievements to watch someone get hit by a car. So that sounds kind of cool. So thank you very much for watching this episode of Lucius 2. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.